A Fort Wayne mother is still rallying for justice nearly two years after her 19-year-old son was shot and killed by police. She just took things a step further and filed a federal lawsuit against the city and the police officers involved. News Channel 15's Megan Royce has uncovered the latest. She joins us live from our newsroom now with more. Megan. Tara, Rose Haney, mother of T.J. Haney, wants the case to go before a federal jury. She says her son's 4th and 14th Amendment rights were violated in April of 2013 when Fort Wayne police officers shot at him 13 times. We want justice for my son, T.J. Nearly two years has passed, and Rose Haney says she still has many unanswered questions. We haven't received any closure to his case. You know, no reports, no police report, no autopsy report, no anything. I need closure for my son. Back on April 27, 2013, police pulled over a vehicle that TJ was a passenger in. Both the driver and TJ jumped out of the car and a foot pursuit with police began. By the end of the chase, TJ was shot up to 13 times and did not have a weapon. Court documents reveal TJ fell after the first shot. Instead of calling for an ambulance, officers put TJ in handcuffs and loaded him into a squad car. His mother says his death was caused by the officer shooting at him and refusing to get him medical care. He wasn't a bad person at all. I love him and I want everybody to know that this could have happened to their son or their daughter. And we're trying to get justice so that the next time They'll think twice and it won't happen. Because of the excessive force and denial of medical care, she wants the case to go to trial. So far, a trial date has not been scheduled. Live in the newsroom, Megan Royst, News Channel 15. Megan.